In this problem, we're told a system does 1.8 times 10 to the 8 joules of work, while 7.5 times 10 to the 8 joules of heat transfer occurs to the environment. What is the change in internal energy of the system, assuming no other change, such as in temperature or by the addition of fuel? So in this problem, we're going to be solving for the change in the internal energy. So we're going to solve for this using the first law of thermodynamics, which tells us the change in the internal energy is equal to the heat, right? So the heat in or out of the system minus the work. So if we want to solve for this, we need Q and we need W. So they tell us that it's going to do 1.8 times 10 to 8 joules of work. And so since the system is going to be doing the work, it's going to be positive. So minus and then 1.8 and it's positive, not negative, because uh, if something was doing system or work on the system, then it would be negative. But in this case, it's just going to be positive. And then we know it's going to do, it says, while 7.5 times 10 to, the, 10 to the 8 joules of heat transfer occurs to the environment. So it's going to be 2, which means it's going to be uh, leaving. So it's going to be negative. So I couldn't really fit it in here, but Q minus it's going to be minus and then 7.5 times 10 to the 8. So basically, it's minus 7.5 times 10, uh, 10 to the 8 minus 1.8 times 10 to the 8. And when you do that, all you got to do is just minus these two numbers. So it's just going to be minus 9.3 and then times 10 to the 8 joules. So the change in the internal energy is going to be equal to minus 9.3 times 10 to the 8, and then it's going to be in joules. So this right here is going to be your answer, and hopefully you found this useful.